Dirt Nerds. I'm George, and it is Dirt 30. Let's see what we're going to be digging into today. What's up, everybody? Yes, I am feeling better. I'm not 100%, but I'm getting there. Um, just a quick heads up for y'all. I have a digestive disorder. This is not a flu. This is not a cold. This is not a seasonal thing. Uh, Sometimes the seasons do play effect on me. Um, but this is a digestive disorder, and I become violently ill, and it really, really sucks. So, but I'm on the upswing, so let's get this over with. <laughs> I got a mail call, and I've got, a, once again, two gift packs to do. Because I was creeping up to the 800 for a while there, uh, right before I got sick, and... I got sick, announced the video, and now I'm over 900, <laughs> creeping up to 1,000. <laughs> Woo! Okay, so, two gift packs to do real quick, and then I'm going to get on to some mail calls. Uh, I tried to separate this out as best I could. There we go. Um, I haven't decided which is which. It doesn't really matter at this point, because they're basically the same. Um, yeah, I'll just go ahead and I'll call it. So this will be the 800 gift pack. So 800 will be uh, this one. Let me make sure I'm going I'm to note it. So this gift pack is for the 800. 800. And the 800 pack is going to consist of, and for the first time ever, I'm adding some coins that I got from Mantic Coins. That is a 1998. No, sorry, not yet. 1998 P Kennedy half dollar with a die crack. And you don't need a loop. You can see the die crack come right off the corner of the bust and go right down between the one and the nine. Big old heavy line. You can see that thing clear as day. So that, that'll be in your pack there. You'll be receiving the one ounce copper Mayan calendar round. You'll be receiving a, oh, see, it's the 100th anniversary, the gift of freedom, 19, or 1886 to 1986, Statue of Liberty, Centennial, Double Eagle, Commemorative Coin. That was donated by Randy Hershey. <coughs> You'll also be receiving a 1936 cleaned but pretty Oop. buffalo nickel it has been cleaned you can tell it's been cleaned and I'm sorry I didn't do it but it's fully readable everything is there beautiful detail really nice coin you'll also be receiving a package of wheats well pennies of sorts there's ten random wheats and an Indian head. They're not the greatest. They're circulated, obviously. Um, some of them are a little beat, but they're readable. You can see what it is. Cool coins. And you'll also be receiving the Postal Commemorative Society, New Jersey, Philadelphia and Denver Mint, uncirculated coins with the card. Again, this one has three stamps, pretty cool, and again, all the state's pertinent information as far as when it became a state and all the fun stuff that happened around that time, and pertinent information about the state, state flag, all that fun stuff. You know, so that's the 800 gift pack. Um, the 900 gift pack is essentially the same, just a couple of small differences. We're going to note that, there's the 900. So you'll still be receiving the same 10 random wheat pennies and an Indian head. But for this one, is going to be receiving a 1971D Kennedy with a die crack on the T. So you'll be getting a scope, or at least a jeweler's loop, and if you look at the T, there will be a die crack coming off of the top of the T. You'll be receiving the American Bison, 
one ounce copper round. Boop, boop. Beautiful, beautiful coin there. And you'll be receiving the same double eagle and the same 1936 buffalo. But this one will be receiving the Georgia Postal Commemorative Society with two circular uncirculated coins, three stamps, states in probe, all that fun stuff. That will be 900. Um, I wanted to do something else with this one, but because of uh, another giant jump and I'm still waiting on things to arrive in the mail, um, obviously the big one right around the corner, 1,000, um, there will be gold. There will be gold in the 1,000 pack. There will be gold, silver, copper, there will be everything. Um, I'm probably going to include uh, some new things. You'll be excited. I got some stuff coming in the mail, and it'll be awesome. So, all right. Those are the gift packs. Thumbs up. <coughs> Move on to some quick shout-outs. So, one of the which is already kind of done. Uh, that's why I was also kind of including those gifts for Mantic coins because this is a quick shout out for Mantic. I was on their stream again this morning or yesterday. Sorry, it's Sunday. Sunday today. But this one comes from uh, back from October 28th. I was on, I believe it was the uh, Mantic is Anonymous, which is their Wednesday treasure hunt. And she found a loot for me. This one is a 97 Kennedy with a die crack. <laughs> Thanks to Mantic Coins, um, not just from my personal donations, but from my personal hunts, I've found so many variety error coins now, it's incredible. So uh, there will be a link in the description below for Mantic Coins. Please, everybody, if you haven't already, and I know everybody, all my dirt nerds are all Mantic Coins fanatics but I do know have a bunch of new subscribers so if you're new to the channel if you're new to the community of coin collecting and whatnot uh, Mantic Coins is a very very good channel to start with so there will be a link in the description below please go check out Shay and Adriana Mantic Coins um, great half dollar live hunts I mean this is I did a five dollar I picked up five rolls from the bank the other day here's all my variety errors that I received from those rolls these are all 1976 five rolls I bought five rolls three of those five rolls were all bicentennials <laughs> but I got one silver I got a 1966 Philadelphia oh yeah not bad picked up five rolls I got a silver uh, I got a nice little stack of varieties. Didn't get no NIFCs, um, but that was cool. That was that was a good hunt. That was well worth it because now I can take all that other money back, put it back in my bank, and buy some more. <laughs> I love it. Coin roll hunting is awesome. So moving on to the next one here. Um, he didn't send any note of notes, and I'm pretty sure I remember he did not want any anything. Recognition wise, I will double check uh, when I go to do this because um, I don't want to say the gentleman's name if he doesn't want to be recognized. But I received a bag of pay dirt in the mail. Uh, I had been sitting on this for a while and didn't know what to do with it, so what better place to do with it or to send it than to the dirt nerd? So this is a little six ounce pay dirt. Uh, the only thing I can see that says on the bag is six ounce pay dirt. It looks like it says gold news. Cool. So thank you. You know who you are. Uh, when I do the package, when I go to do the pay dirt, um, I will have all the pertinence as far as, you know, if the gentleman wanted to be shouted out and whatnot. Um, or lady or whoever it was. So 
And let's see, and this was actually, this was from Ray's World. Um, he sent this along with, uh, if you watched uh, his video the other day, uh, the silver pour that I did for him. I, w I wish it would have came out a little cleaner. I was trying to go for a big, like a double stack medallion where the Ray's World coin was in the center. And then there was going to be like another raised coin around the outside of that. So it kind of looked like a double stacker. Um, it, there wasn't enough silver. I thought there was going to be more. <laughs> it, it looked like there was going to be more. My eyeballs in the mold didn't quite mesh. So, But I got me some of my, my, my coins from my nickel roll hunt. I did a donation, so I got a penny pull. So I got me a nice wheat penny. Well, no, it's not even a wheat penny. It's a 71S. It's one of the many, many 71S's that he's been coming across lately on his penny hunt. So I'll put that with my penny hunts, or with my penny rolls. But I'm going to go through this. Uh, I'll go on a different video, show you my nickel books, but I'll go through uh, the nickels that I received from Ray and see if I can fill up my book. I'm just about there on both my uh, 62 to 95 and 38 to 61 bucks. They're, they're both getting, getting up there pretty good. Doing pretty well with that. So... Go check out Ray's World. Go check out that video he just did with the uh, with the 925 pour that I did to, did for him. It was a little custom job. Um, working on getting some better things, you know, again to make better molds and do better castings and everything. But it was it was just something off the off the cuff, kind of just something to do for him. All right. And now this one, I know I can shout this guy out. Mr. Daryl USA. Uh, I was on SJ's live stream a while back and he was talking about these uh, encapsulated pennies. And he said, he'd, and I was just like, well, that sounds neat. You know, he showed, sent a picture, I think, to SJ and I was like, oh, those are really cool. That That is, that is really cool looking. Said, I'll send you one. So it was a 1960D penny. And it's encapsulated in a soda cap. And <laughs> a little flip cap. How cool is that? So thank you, Daryl. That is that is just one of the coolest things I've I I, I think that is pretty damn cool. <laughs> thank you for that, my friend. They, that that is that is just totally totally neat. I, that is unique. And then this one is uh, from one of my Patreon members as well. He's also a subscriber and a fellow dirt nerd. I cut it open here and I kind of peeked a little bit. There's a lot of dirt in here. But there's also a note. So let's get the dope. It is Dirt 30. <laughs> That's right, my friend. All right. Ooh, that's a nice long note. I like that. This is, hey, fellow dirt nerd. Here is a gift bag for you. There are some coins I pick up from all over. The five cent trade token I detected in my yard. Cool. It's from the mining days and were used at the company stores. The Mason coin I found in 1960 while looking for arrowheads. That's awesome. My, uh, or my looking for looking for arrowheads. My first coin I got excited about. The wheat penny was shot by a 90-year-old lady at about 75 yards with a 22 pistol. From her kitchen, oh, from her kitchen door. <laughs> wow. The beach sand I got from Lake Superior this summer after a big, after a big blow that created 60 foot waves that went up into the trees and washed the roots. I dug under the roots to get it. That sand hasn't seen the light of day in a hundred years or better. 
That's cool. The stones slash gems are found all along the Keweenaw. I hope I pronounced that right. I live in an area that has a lot of Native American names, so Kawina. I'm still sick too, so. Uh, Kawina Shore near where I lived. The copper I find all over while metal detecting. Cool. Keep what you like and pass on the rest. If you would like more copper nuggets, let me know. I have more than my house can hold. <laughs> 60 plus years worth. Plus I have many agates and the stones were polished by the lake. Dirt nerd forever. Cool. So, let me pause you real quick, folks, and I'll show you the bag here. The wifey just woke up, so I gotta go tend to the wifey. I'll be back in just a minute. Alright, we're back. <coughs> Sorry. So, as we were, we were just finishing up, uh, just read the letter from, from Joe there. Uh, again, when I go to do the, I'll do a video with this pay dirt. When I do, I'll make sure to give him full shout outs and everything. I want to make sure that, uh, double check emails and everything that, uh, he want that he wants a shout out that he did not want to remain anonymous. Uh, some folks, um, do may wish to remain anonymous and that's totally fine with me. So this one is black sand, copper nuggets, agates from Michigan. So that's pretty cool. I see some cool rocks in there. And every, everything in here is polished by the beach. It was found on the beach, polished by, by the lake. That's pretty cool. And there's another bag. And this one is black sand, coins, token, copper, silver. And I can't... Like hair beads, I guess, maybe? I'm not sure. Some of the some of the ink got rubbed off, so it's kind of hard to read all of it there. But it's all Lake Superior black sand. That's pretty dang cool. And that is some that is some dark sand right there. That is some black sand. <laughs> Dirt nerd like. So I will be doing a video with with both this painter and the uh, and the other one there that was that was that was gifted to me. And again, as well as all kinds of stuff coming in the mail, um, silver for pours, um, silver for giveaways. Sil you know, I got some gold painter coming in. Um, it just yeah, all kinds of all kinds of goodness. Everybody will be quite happy, I, I believe. So, uh, you'll be seeing me again soon here. I'll, I'll be posting again in a couple days. I'll be doing some pay dirts. Uh, probably be doing it here in the coin corner because it is freezing outside. It is it is cold, 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 cold. Like, literally, my tubs are frozen. Uh, not thick yet, so I may, you know, if I wait till later afternoon, I may be able to... Uh, to do some panning or something, you know, do some, do some, uh, do some mailbox prospecting then. But it all depends on weather. Sun's kind of out, so if it thaws, then, then we'll be good. See what happens. All right, dirt nerds. Hope you enjoyed this quick video. Make sure that. Oh, sorry. Yes. Uh, for the gift packs, this is this is the video. Um. Leave a comment, as always, it's going to be a random comment generated off of this video, one week from today. It is open to everybody as long as your country allows you to receive the gift, as always. That's how I've always done it, that's how it's always been. It is up to you to ensure that you can receive the gift. Um, I do double check when I go to send the gift. I check with my postal carrier you know, I go to the office and I, and I say okay I'm sending to this country uh, you know to this area where is it okay to send it what are my restrictions 
Um, so I, I double check before I send because I don't want it getting lost in customs or stuck somewhere for months on end and then tore up, shipped back to God knows where, to me or to whatever. You know. So please make sure I will do the same. One comment, one comment only. Uh, you can comment as many times as you like, but I will use a filter, uh, duplicate, duplicate filter uh, deal. So, you know, only one comment will count. So leave a comment below um, and please try to make it a decent comment. Um, you know, just the, the, the hellos and thank yous are cool, um, but I like a little, a little bit of substance, you know, to let me know that you watched the video. <laughs> more than five seconds um, and as always uh, like I said one week from today it's Sunday so uh, I will draw it'll go till Sunday next week and then I will draw the winners on Monday or the winner yeah winners sorry the winner for the 800 winner for the 900 on Monday um, of you know one week from today you know you get it there will be all everything. Will, all the information will be in the description below as far as the dates, times, cutoffs, when the giveaway will end, and as far as entries. Um, and yeah, I think that's about it for right now. Uh, I'm still kind of a little not here. Um, I just wanted I wanted to get in here and do something for y'all. Uh, I'm feeling a little better, so you know, especially especially when I get some some dirt in the mail and all kinds of packages that I've been sitting on for a minute that I wanted to get get everybody's shout outs to so uh, Mantic Coins, Ray's World um, and uh, I believe it was Daryl USA are the three main ones for today the other ones I you know like I said the pay dirt ones I uh, I will if, if if they wish to remain anonymous will remain anonymous and I will just have a video with some playing me in the, with me playing in the dirt Otherwise, uh, they will get the shout out when I go to do the video. Uh, I'm sorry, I can't give you more information right now. Um, just because, again, this this just just came in like yesterday, and um, I want to make sure I get permissions and that it's not, you know, that they want to you know stay stay in the shadows, which is fine. So, don't forget to leave your comment. Um, whatever comments is good, just as long as it is a a good comment. So one week from today, I will draw the names, send out send out some awesome packs again, and when I hit the thousand, you heard me. Gold, silver, copper, all kinds of greatness. There will be some some cool stuff. Anybody wants to donate to the channel, uh, anything to add to the giveaway pack, you will get shout outs and and all that for said add additions and gifts to the. Uh, to the channel so right on all right so everybody have yourself a wonderful day wonderful afternoon wonderful evening wherever you are it is dirt 30 somewhere see you on the next one